Howdy everyone, I'm back again. We've got ourselves a beautiful spring day here in North Dakota. Couldn't ask for a better day for some kayak fishing. I'm excited for this one too. We're gonna to try for smallmouth bass today. I haven't caught one in about six months. They're my favorite fish to target. So I'm hoping I can hook into my first one of the year. I am pumped to get out there. I got my kayak all loaded up. Let's go see if we can find them. I'm hoping that temperature gauge on my fish finder comes up a little bit. It says 47.2 right now. It's probably got to acclimate to the water temp a little bit still. Air temperature is only about 40 degrees right now, but a few days ago we had 80 degree temps. The sun was shining. The day after it was 70 degrees. Sunny, kind of windy, but that helps to warm up the water sometimes. I'm expecting low to mid 50s by the time the transducer in there adjusts to the water temp. But it's early May right now. The bass are maybe two to three weeks away from starting spawn. Hopefully they're looking to eat. I've had a few people tell me that this corner of the lake down here is a good spot to try this time of year. So I'm going to work my way down there. We'll maybe start off at this point here and just kind of work the shoreline for that five to ten foot depth range. I think I'm going to start out with the jerk bait today. We'll toss that around a little bit and if we can find them I've got a Nico leech tied on a little eighth ounce jig. So if we can find the fish we'll probably throw that leech but I'll use that jerk bait to try to search them out first. Right now I'm just working my way along with the jerk bait. I've got a Rapala Shadow Rap Shad. Perch color one. This is the deep runner. I know there's a lot of perch on this lake too, so I'm pretty sure the smallies take advantage of that. If the water was murky, I'd probably throw a white or maybe a clown colored one, but it's actually pretty clear out here. Most of these lakes are in the springtime, then by midsummer the algae blooms take over. A whole bunch of birds up here in this bay. That's a good sign. Oh, there's a fish right there. Right as I said that, my jerk bait got slammed. Oh, it's a smallie. Oh, it's a big smallie. Oh, get the net. Come here. Whoa. Hey, you watch those hooks there, bud. Get him unhooked before he does anything too crazy. Got that one on the jerk bait. Wow, how about that for the first smallmouth of the year? It's got to be a good 18, 18 and a half incher. I'll give him a quick measure since that's my first one. 17 and three quarters. Not a bad way to start the day. See if we can get another one. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of birds back there. Maybe these fish are gonna be schooled up in this little bay right here. There's another one. Look at that, back-to-back -back casts. I'm gonna paddle myself backwards here a little bit. The wind is pushing me that way, the fish are pulling me that way. 
I don't want to drift right to the school of them if there is a school of them up there. I'm getting fish on back-to-back -back casts. I'd say there's a pretty good chance there's more up there. Come here, bud. How are you hooked there? There we go. Fish number two. Very next cast after that first one. All right, are we on them? <laughs> I don't want to get too confident after what happened last time. <laughs> Water temp hasn't really come up much. It's still only 47.7. But the fact that we got a couple fish in, I like it. There's a fish. Well, I switched over to my jig and just threw it out there, pretty much let it sink, gave it one little twitch. And ooh, I got a nice molly here. Oh, come here, you. Wow, look at this molly. Alright, hey, 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 settle down. Jeez. That is a thick one right there. Get him unhooked, and I'll show you guys what I got him on. A little black Nico leech on an eighth ounce Kitech jig. Yeah, that one nailed it. Nice thick smallmouth. Well, I caught my first one over there. I did work my way into the bay. It's kind of shallow in there. I didn't see much other than one little pike and a whole bunch of turtles. So I figured I'd come back out here. I've got a little bit of a rocky point. I think it extends out a little ways there. Second one off of this point right here. I got my anchor in my net, or else I would net him. <laughs> that works. Nice. Another one on that Nico leech. Nice, thick little smolly. Man, I miss catching these guys. This one feels like a solid fish. Please be a bass. Oh, it's a walleye. That's a nice walleye too. Come here, bud. Wow, look at that. Walleye on that Nico leech. Man, 
man, what a beautiful fish. Tempted to keep that one, but I don't really feel like dragging fish around on a stringer the rest of the day. So we'll let him go. Nice walleye though. kind of dragging that jig along or giving it small little pops. This one came and picked it up. I'm having an awesome time out here today. Getting on them pretty good. I wasn't sure what to expect with the water temp at about 48 degrees, but they're hungry. I like it. Not a whole lot of action out here the last hour. The wind picked up a little bit, kind of blew me off the spot that I was fishing down there. So I worked my way along the shoreline, trying to stay out of the wind. Not even a bite. That's okay, I'm starting to get hungry anyway. So I think I'm gonna head back over here to the launch, get my gear loaded up and go grab some lunch. It's been an awesome morning out here though. Caught my first smallie of the year, so I'm thrilled about that. Got several more to go along with that one. Even caught a bonus walleye too. Got a couple fish on that jerk bait. Most of them we caught out here today were on that Nico leech. First time I've tried one of them. I'm pretty impressed with that. I think that'll be staying in my Smalley arsenal. Yeah, it's been an awesome morning out here. I enjoyed it. I hope you guys did too. Thanks for coming along with me again. I'll see you next time.